This week began as last week ended, with markets once again under pressure. There was little discernible progress for investors coming out of the G20 meeting which was held at the end of last week. This very much underwhelmed markets and saw them tumble down once again. The focus for Europe right now is on the problems in Italy. Italy is the third most indebted country in the world and it's clear to say that if Italy were to fold, this could be the end of the Euro Eurozone. What this meant for New Zealand is once again the risk on theme meant that markets were under pressure here and our New Zealand dollar once again underperformed. Currently we are trading around 79.60 against the US dollar. The movements in our, US, in our New Zealand dollar are once again focusing on what is happening in the Dow Jones, which seems somewhat of a barometer for global sentiment at present. With the ongoing turbulence around global markets at present, our economics team has lowered our estimates for when the Reserve Bank of New Zealand will increase the official cash rate. At one stage we are expecting the first move in the official cash rate to be around September of this year. However, with the troubles in Europe intensifying significantly, we have pushed this out as far as mid-2012. The reason for this is that global markets have really come to the conclusion that this European sovereign debt crisis is here to stay. Greece seemed to be the minor player in this overall debacle. This is due to the fact that they have five times less debt than that of Italy. And now Italy is firmly in the headlines of investors and bond yields there have pushed up significantly. What this means for the global environment is that GDP is probably going to lower for the overall growth in the world. And for New Zealand this will mean that there is little incentive to increase the official cash rate. Once the official cash rate tightening cycle does start to take hold, we believe it will be more gradual than we initially anticipated, and the official cash rate should top out at around 4% in the latter half of 2013.